Hi guys, I'm Daddy Freeze, convener of the Free the Sheeple Movement and leader of the Free Nation in Christ. I greet you and I bring glad tidings. Today I have a special video and I'll be featuring a very beautiful and intelligent young lady who is popularly known to all and sundry on Instagram as Ajoke Ewaid. And we're talking about our traditional religions, our traditional belief systems. And the topic is pinned right there for you. Should a connection with our ancestors be considered or tagged evil? So, I hope she hasn't slept off on me because I've been here chatting with her. Hmm. Edekuti Bobriskiu. Hmm. Eye yomi. Ekuti Bobriski atitontu. Chai. Hmm. Ngozi Roha said, absolutely not. Are you serious? All right, so I'm waiting for Ajoke right now. Ajoke, waiting for you. You know, in uh, joined already. Okay, say hi so I can add you. Yes, and Leo. Mm. Hey. Thank God. <laughs> you, have, you now look like me and you are in the same place because we have the same curtain. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. That's right. How are you doing? Tell us. <laughs> that you freeze. I'm fine, thank you, sir. In fact, I'm so tired. I lost my voice. I've been on the road. But today, now today. You've been on the road. Of, you've been on the road <clears throat> doing. Hustling, hustling, and bustling. Ah, hmm. I've been on the road once, yeah. but the moment I saw that that the freeze is ready for us today, I was like, today not today. Today not today. I had to look for something to take and just gain my voice a little bit so that okay. I can. Let's start with giving us a little bit of history about you. Tell us about yourselves. Okay, my name is Princess Adejo Keshumwe popularly known as AYD. I'm an African art revitalist. Hmm. I promote Yoruba language. Hmm. I promote the cultural traits of the African people. Hmm. I, I promote my culture with so much pride and elegance. I hmm. wear strictly adire. I speak. Can we see what you're wearing? Can you stand and up? This is adire. Yeah, it's adire. Hmm. Yeah, because I sell African fabrics, Adire and Asha Oke. I sell African cosmetics, Ori, Adi Agonwi. I am a talking drummer. I sell drum. Do I... you have a talking drum here? No, I have that in my office. Oh, okay. So, so why I do... Where is your... Sorry, where is your office? In Abel Kuta, Ogun State. Oh, where do you live? I live in Abel Kuta Ogun State. I'm a princess in Egbalake in Abel Kuta Ogun State. Mm, mm. So um I yes, I'm a I'm an African art revitalist. I just decided myself that I want to promote the language that belongs to us. And I do so much now because a lot of people think probably I wasn't educated. That's the reason I speak Yoruba. People will say, I'm also Yoruba, so mommy will. People will say, I'm mommy will Yoruba. So when I came up with that, um, I have a foundation, Bagede Ewaide Foundation. The Ewaide means the beauty of Yoruba language. Bagede mm. means platform. So the name of the foundation is Bagede Ewaide Foundation, means a platform to showcase the beauty mm. of the Yoruba people. Mm. 
I, I studied, um, I have a um, HND MASCOM, BS History and International Relations. I proceeded to do my master's in Yoruba. All the universities I approached said, no, I have to get um, a Yoruba degree. So I'm a I'm, I'm few years to 40 years, I'm almost 40, but I chose to go back to the university to study Yoruba so that I can have my doctorate degree in Yoruba language. Where wait, am I doing all this? Wait, 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 wait. You have HND. Mascom. From which school? Moshun Abela Polytechnic. You now have a degree again. History and international relations. History and international relations. And then you are back to the university again. Yes, to study Yoruba, to have BSc Yoruba, because all the universities are saying... You have a master's in Yoruba and then a PhD in Yoruba. Yes, that's, that's, that's my focus now. Wow. How many years have you, are you in the university? How did you get back into do you, do, do you want to tell me that you went back to do jam again or how did you get back into it? It's a direct entry. So I just, I just in fact, I'm, I'm in 200 level. Let me say I just finished processing the admission. What university is that? Uh, Olabisi Onobanjo University. Okay, okay. And, okay. and why I'm doing this Four is, more years or three more years? It's three more years. It's a four years course. Hmm. Yeah, it's a four years course. So why I'm doing that is because I want our people to know that Yoruba niwa... First, first, first. Everybody just first clap for Adi Joke. Please. Eh? Somebody is so proud of Yoruba after already having a degree. Your, your degree was in mass come to have History and international relations. History and international relations. But I did ND and HND in mass communication. And ND and HND in mass communication. Some people, HND is enough for them to work. It's not enough. She has HND. She has yeah. BSc. But then she's now going back again to get another BSc so she can be properly grounded in Yoruba language. Exactly. Can we put our hands together? Show some love. Let me see the love signs pouring. Thank and you. When people go abroad and they study Hebrew language or Greek or all these other <laughs> languages, we respect them. When oh, we'll now be doing it palasa like it's not important. Abi, huh. I don't speak Yoruba. Kogbo Yoruba. My children doesn't speak Yoruba. They don't speak Yoruba. So, I came up with that foundation. My foundation will be 10 years in December. Hmm. And, and what I do in that foundation is I go to schools, primary and secondary schools, to tell those students, those children, that Yoruba, it is not vernacular. Vernacular means a day. I want to you, I want to go. Nobody can tell me that as beautiful, as smart, intelligent that I am, you now tell me, a day, Timo, so, a day, ala, I mm -hmm. now come to realize it. Okay? I want you to guess it. I want you to guess it. Guess it. That free is more doable. Hmm. More mm. doable. Hmm. So I have the opportunity of be, I have the opportunity of meeting people. Baba wale show inka. Afito bajakwe enche. Maybe it's a, it's an official thing or it's a news or it's something. So just people yah want to want to be a no. He doesn't speak English. Even me, um, Tori, I want you to buy Yoruba. Lara, audience, wa. Yeah. Exactly. Uh, just said is for those of us on the platform who don't understand Yoruba, whatever she says, she'll interpret it to you. Yeah. As you are. Yoruba mi dogo. Yes, in fact, the very our clap back. Yoruba man, our people yo money oro. Oh, oh, already but that I also hear that me. Let me tell you, I don't see say Instagram. If you wish clap back, they they report them. I go Yoruba from the village. No wonder. Make Mark Zuckerberg go I'm by. I want Yoruba a man, go man, tick. <laughs> So 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 I'm so I'm so proud of you. Um, and now let's talk a little bit about your religion. What is your religion? Let me even ask. Yeah, you. I'm a Christian. That is okay. I'm a born Muslim. My Muslim mm. name is Shukran Lai, meaning mm. Erundupe. 
mm. out to Arabic school. Mulone kill dada mu kill. But my Amin. mom ran. Yes, yes, I went to Arabic school. Did I can do, do I can did recite. What this? Did you finish Quran? Yes, I I I did. Um, one man kweni sauki al Quran. Eh. Olimat. Olimat, yes. Yeah, yeah. I went to Yas Salam Arabic school. Whoever knows Abekuta will know that Yas Salam Arabic school is a very great Arabic school in Abekuta. Mm. So my mom was an alaja. My dad an alaji, list of blessed memory. But my mom was an alaja. So sometimes in the journey, my mom converted. She became a Christian. So I went to church with my mom, you know. But later, I stopped going to my mom's church because our church is far. So by the time we come back home, the lemma tissue, you know, we have to prepare for school the following day. So I started going to a church that is close by. Later, I found myself in Celestial Church of Christ. So as I speak to you, I'm a bona fide member, committed member of Celestial Church. Not only that, I'm a senior elder prophetess of Celestial Church. I'm a prophetess. I have cape with my garments. I have lace on my garments. And I also have yellow regalia on my garments. And in Celestial Church, you don't wear all those things if you don't get to that cater. So you start so, from... And Yes, to the glory of God. Mm. To the glory of God. I go into trance, I give messages. In fact, this Yoruba revitalization that I'm doing, that is why I try my best to explain to people. You know, some people look at me and say, Oh, Yoruba, oh, Yoruba, like, Konimini, see ya when you come. But when I tell people, I said, This is my destined assignment. You should tell her that I she like in here. And some people say, joke, oh, ni ro won di ki ni yi. You know, why don't you talk sex? Some will say, why don't you talk entertainment? You have a very beautiful face. Why don't you? I said, no problem. But Isheti, you know that the earlier you recognize and identify what you no, are, also. the better it is for you. So the moment I got that message in the spiritual realm. Mm. And I got it. I held on to it. That, okay. This is why I'm here. I'm a born princess, but boya be a leader she fell carry me. So I I started with Celestial Church of Christ, and I'm still in Celestial Church of Christ. I started with um four corner, no, with round round neck. We call us Onibodi, ushers, and all of us on no no with um yellow loins. Onibode means more like a gate man or something. Yes, like Onibode, yeah, like I want to like ushers. Tomadro yeah. no, you know. So I was in the cleaning section of the church. Then later I graduated into Cape in Onibode. Still having my yellow loin. So later I was I had to they had to change my garments into that of the prophetess. Because I'm spiritual message me okay flow. So because the amre of Osha only body oh yeah to city woolly woolly blue blue. So English that they can understand. Yeah, from... for the for the um how do I call them? Only body is different from the ushers is different from that to, of prophets. You are trying as an usher. As an usher. Person, not working out well because you yes. needed to be proper prophetess. Yes, yes. So mm. reasons I had to change my garments into that of a prophetess, which is four corner then blue. Sorry, sorry. Somebody complained. Your camera is a bit. I think when you were setting up your camera, you you touch the camera with your finger. Do you oh. have a piece? Just clean. Let me just get the wipe and clean. Wipe, perfect. So we can see you clearly. I want to see you. Clearly. You are fine for me to us to be seeing you from. I want people get achievement for this life. Hey, hey. <laughs> HND BSC prophetess. Ah, 
And I won't lie, I respect select prophetess and pass all our Pentecostal. Kabu, kabu, is it better now? Guys, is it better? Is it better? It's better. Do it again. Just the camera itself. I think it's your network, but. Is it... Guys, is it better? Yeah, I think. Is it better? Yeah. Yes. Okay. Uh -huh. We can. I can see your facial features better now. The person okay. is right. Okay. So, I need to. Con the, my shepherd now told me that this thing that is happening, you have to change your garments into that of a prophetess. We all know you are a prophetess, but I didn't want to leave that offering department because there's something in celestial church that I've come to realize is that if you clean the church, if you clean the church, just leave yourself as a messenger or a servant, you come to realize the fact that okay, those that are cleaning the church will be doing better. Because physically, one rare one let them become so humble. Hmm. The one cleaning the church. And spiritually, they grow. I don't hmm. know. I don't know. I don't want to call it a myth, but I don't know what, what is happening in that area. No, so in no, my it, church, you see big boys, big girls, parking uh, their cars under the tree to come and wash the toilets and clean the church. So I was enjoying that department. I didn't want to leave. Mm, 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 so you mm, see somebody, Tojekwe, is just mm, like the regular person with mm, a sachet of pure water. And you see a big madam pick that such and put it inside her pocket because she doesn't want to, the ground to be littered. Mm. So that I learned in Celestial Church. I don't know how it's working. Oh, no, 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 no. It's very powerful. Uh -huh. So then I noticed that... Chapter 4, verse 10. Okay. Humble yourself before the Lord and he will lift you up. Lift you up, exactly. It, it is a command. Yes. Humble before the Lord and he will, he will lift, lift you up. up. In fact, if they are looking for broom, Igbale, in my church, they may call my phone and say, Igbale, Igbale, you know, like joking mm. like mm. that because they know that this is our department. And Even, even Luke, even uh, the book of Luke chapter 1 verse 52, he has brought down rulers from their throne and exalted the humble. humble. So it's all about Christ himself washed people's legs. Exactly. So is 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 a very powerful Christian doctrine. Making yourself, bringing yourself down from a level where you are, making yourself humble before God is very very powerful, uh, and that works. It's a Christian doctrine. So I didn't want to leave that department, but my shepherd says, "Okay, I am a shepherd, and I don't bother me." You know, we we annually <laughs> visit. Uh -uh. Annually, we visit in Mecca. My shepherd will lead us to go and clean the auditorium. So now said, becoming a prophetess does not stop what you are doing. So to cut the long story short, I had to change my garments and I became a prophetess and like that, like that. And I, be, I started growing spiritually to the glory of God. Now, as a prophetess, okay. I have a calling to promote and protect the cultural value of the African people, especially Yoruba. Mm. So when I begin to do all those things, some people will say, ah, Oti Shawo, Oti Lo Shawo, Oti Wegbe O, Oti Shedis. She has joined cult. She's now occultic. She's now into Juju. She's now into this. She's now into that. It took me so many years to just get myself grounded that mm. now let me say something my first year of celebrating my foundation when i started working i i was highlighting some names of people that i will work with on a sunday afternoon my shepherd was in trance and he called for me i went to him and he said this man called saido shupa 
Mm. My shepherd is my shepherd is a young shepherd, but I thank God. I celebrate God in his life. He is persona addict. Yes. My shepherd is persona addict. So when he told me he was in trance and was giving me that message, I was like, oh, the sorrow. He was like, he will not call you by your name, more, even if he's older than you. He will say, oh, you know, he's like that. But when you talk of Paso, my shepherd will say, can you call, can you call, can you call? So we have relationship, everybody have relationship with him. So when he mentioned Saido Shupa, I was like, ah, oh, Lucio, oh, Shupa. Okay. So I started. Um, I'm following him on Instagram. He's following me to amazing, one of my favorite Fuji artists. Yes, fully loaded. Oh. So oh. when I went to Saido Shupa, I went to his house. We were talking. I said, ah, this is what I have in mind. This is my project. And he looked at me and he said, are you sure you are ready to do this thing? I said, I'm ready. So I said, she to bat in logo. Oh, ni sokpo. She ma said, you know, will not be missing. No, Allah, my princess. No, Allah, not be missing. So this is about passion and not about money. Hmm. That somebody should go into his room upstairs to bring one CD plate. This CD, that one won't buy. The guy hmm. brought it. Okay. He said, what is the name of my foundation? I said, AYD. He said, okay. I went to brought that CD. He gave it to me. It was dusty. He gave it to me. And I checked the name on that CD. Guess what? They wrote LYD Yoruba. Hmm. And Said Yoruba said, Can you get to alone for almost 10 years? But he is a busy person. There is no how he can now put this one on his head again. He now said, Joker, you will sign legal papers. I said, I'm ready. You will do this. I said, I'm ready. You will do that. I said, I'm ready. So Zaido Shukwa came on board, Kogba Kobo. We started working together. We started year one, second year, third year, fourth year. It got busy at some point. But see, your mother basha had baby Kono. And will be a normal woman you die. So when I see Oshukwa, I tell him, I said, when you are counting your achievements, please make sure you add Joker to it. Now, why are we here? It's because of the fact that people say, as a princess, uh, as a prophetess, you are promoting Yoruba. How can you promote the African culture without talking about the tradition? Hmm. So when when people enter my my office, I I sell African crafts, I sell African drums, I take talking drum abroad. It is what I say. So when they enter my, oh, I don't, when you see me buy ornaments, buy, I want cut off and decorate me. I am Africa, Africa, Africa. All my head is Africa, 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 Africa. So when they see these things, even when I'm taking pictures, my photo shoots, they see my regalia, they see that, oh, this person, oh, Tilo Shawo, oh, Mohi, oh, Tilo Shekbe, you know, she's beginning to join all these cults, all those cults. I'm now trying my best to say that. Connecting to our ancestors. Our ans I, the way that, that is, the way I see my ancestor is like be Mosheri um, and not be Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. He was a prophet. You know, the same thing with Orumila. Orumila came on board, did all he was sent by a to marry, and he went as we speak. I call on Nirisha. I call him my ancestors and my ancestor. The reason is the present Oni is a, a reincarnation of Odudu Ahatewo. Mm. So if you look at him spiritually, you will see that he's a reincarnated being. So mm. I want, but most of our kings should be seen as our ancestors. So when I say, okay, oh, the Sheshe people are doing their own, it is just like we Christians, we, we talk to God in the name of Yeshua. Some people will call him Jesus. Yes. Okay. The Muslims, mm. through Anobi Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, Anobi Muhammad. I want Christian, no. 
won gba fun Jesus Christ Oluwa wa awon oni sese orun mi la la won gba fun challenge ton fi fo bele da soro ni e o se wa dogun hmm let me let me let me let me let me take um let me take it from you at this point okay sir uh my dad is muslim um so my mom is roman catholic okay. i was born roman catholic baptized roman catholic uh then when i came over to nigeria as a three-year-old child in 1979 um i went to a catholic primary school studied primary school you know the whole catholic everything mm -hmm. primary school as i was finishing primary school my father started introducing us to islam Yeah. Also went to Ilekeu. It's just that most stubborn dear me, Barry. Well, no, you go. Ilekeu, repeating in Ilekeu is not, is not, <laughs> you know, man, no, hey, me, that book, you know, that Quran, you know, one learn. you go learn now. But what she says, any day you finally come, why do you know what you're doing? You understand? So yeah. I, I read as I could from Ilekeu. But I also attended um, Ahmadiyya Mosque. And I learned as much as I could about the heritage of Islam uh, before I went to university and said, you know what, uh, I'm going to be a Christian. And I went into Pentecostalism before I finally got to where I am now that we run our own church. And there's one thing I need you to learn. For you to study Islam, you must study Arabic. Yeah. That's Ilekeu. Keu. Keu. Mean Arabic. Ilekeu means the house of Arabic. Arabic. Arab it's, not, it's not the house of Islam. You don't go to Ilekeu to learn Islam. No. Ilekeu to learn Arabic. Amen? Mm. Now, the life and times of the Prophet Muhammad wasalam, are depicted in a book called the Hadith. Hadith, yeah. For you to be able to study the Quran or the Hadith, you have to understand Arabic. Very well. For you to read Quran. Where am I going to? And these are the languages of the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Family and so for you to understand Islam in the proper context, you have to study the language. Which is Arabic. Same thing with Christianity. One of the reasons why in my church we don't use Jesus is because Jesus is a new word. It does, J does not exist in Hebrew. In Hebrew. J did not even exist in English until 400 years ago. But many of you don't know any, or many people don't know anything because they just take whatever they are being fed. Exactly. Exactly. Grounded in Christianity, you have to either study Hebrew or have Hebrew scholars that teach you or Hebrew scholars whose works you read. And then the New Testament was now written in Greek. For you to understand the New Testament, you have to start studying Greek or else they will use English to mislead you. Why do Muslims don't allow you to study their Quran in English? In English. To go back, you first have to learn Arabic first then. before you can enter Quran. Now, what religion did, both Islam and Christianity, what they did, because whether you like it or not, religion to me is like KFC, McDonald's, Burger King, Coke, Sprite, Fanta, their brands. Yeah. This brand will come and tell you that this brand is better than the other brand. That's why Muslims will tell you that a Christian will not make heaven and Christians will tell you that they will not make heaven. Why would you have gone to that heaven and come back? <laughs> Except the people that are high on other things and think they've gone to heaven and come back. <laughs> so, at the end of the day, our traditions are very important. Especially the good ones. Because let me ask, Bible tradition day, we me, I know they collect. Ephesians chapter 6, verse 5. Slaves, obey your earthly masters. I know they follow them. Me, mm -hmm. I don't collect. They said, do not add anything to the book. The whole Bible is something they added something to. When they, when they carry a Bible and say, the Bible says, do not add or remove. 
I said, I said, who is the person that told you to add it? The Bible that today they add this, tomorrow they add that. The things they cut and paste inside. Who, revised, because, revised, revised, revised. Now brought it to you and said, you should not add. The people that have been adding since the day die. Please, 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 let's leave it. So what am I trying to say in essence is our cultural heritage, not just even as Yoruba, as Africans. Africans. A white man will come and bring their culture. Islam is Middle Eastern culture. Christianity is European. The Christianity we have in Nigeria is European culture. It's not even the Middle Eastern Christianity. We have the Roman Anglo-Saxon Christianity. The one that they coined and toiled and they put inside the pot and make arch and banga and everything to come and bring you this one that they will use to muinleru, hold you as slave. So you also have to understand your heritage. In Nigeria, I find it offensive that we throw our heritage away and carry another man's own and put on our head. Muinleru, a fatiwadani. Eh, one more got to sir. When you enter museums in Lagos, you will enter and take pictures, do your own go if you are a spiritual person. You know that there are different between spiritual and religion. A lot of people do not know. Brother, yo, if you enter museums abroad, Ori Mama Didebai, because the original Ekwegun, the original Ere, the original things to jet it to Africans, Oti were playing, Oti Losong. So that is why you enter. You know what a kwegu is? A kwegu is the cloth of a masquerade. Of a masquerade. But when Kanto jet, you are never done on Gessi day. They said, "But when Kini Yoda, Ivu ni, Ivu ni, when Kanto Ivu ni, la wakolo." They took it away. Now, yes, I entered their museums. Only me man she buy. Be an original. Why be by no one say? Joker. Yes, sir. Those are our own that they said we should burn. Mm. The original ones they took it abroad. What you know? Well, that our ancestor that is disturbing us, that is not letting us progress, that we are burning our own heritage. The, why is it not letting them progress? How come they that have the original one they are progressing? They have the original ones, not to call and them. have the fake one or the copy copy of our own tradition. We are regressing. And it is ah, is you, you in, in your family you mm. you use masquerade. Please, a dark web by me, Father Christmas. No masquerade. In the act of. Please continue. I'm enjoying you. I'm enjoying you. I'm enjoying you. So, why I'm here is because I I attend the Free Nature, uh, Nation Church when I don't. Ah, uh -uh. yes, now I'm a member. Ah, uh ah. -uh. <laughs> so, at some point, I just noticed that, okay, this is something that I can. Put out of myself, like multi bottle, multi bottle to this stage, because a lot of people will say, "I joke, you are a prophetess. How can a prophetess or a Christian be promoting, you know, African tradition?" And I'll say, "Okay, there is a clear difference between being spiritual and being religious. I am a bona fide celestial member. I tell people, I said, 'Sele olok my nimi.'" Mm. Because in celestial church, if there is one thing you cannot take away from us, is open. Cash service fifteen in a day. Open my one go go. Nino kotele to marry them bury. The only thing that God is asking everybody is come to Now I want to see one share is sharing. Inu one more do our one church. I can want to one lomo shalashi. Lati joti won fi ise se bura o se ni to nwu wa ka because o mo gbo to ma fo ogun bura fo my i have my uncles my I sisters have... my aunts are politicians my uncles i have a lot of them that are politicians so when we talk we joke and i say ah to ba fi so bura fun governor pe okay o ogun lakayo osimole olomile for jewe la so le fi mo ki mo bura teni ba ji owo wa but I don't want to feel by at Pura to Bura leaders. I want to want to shake in the ye. 
English and when you're a boss, so they are they are, oh. they are enjoying you so much, but they want you to come. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm I'm speaking in English because I'm here. Upgrade and learn the language. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so what I'm saying is the uh, how do I put it? When they said um people are coming into office and they said, Okay, oh, the kinebulani guess, you know. Uh, swear. Okay, they want to swear. You know, they swear by the Korean and the Bible. Yes. But look at what is going on in our country. The moment we start using the traditional way to swear, you will see that everybody will see that. Well, so yes, is, everybody. Don't hear we say, call Ayilala. Let's say, because it's an instant judgment. Let me tell you where Ayilala is wicked, eh? If you choose somebody and say, ah, this person is doing me wicked, I want to send Ayala to you, and that person will not do you anything. Now you, the Ayala, you come back. Ayala, if you won't use Ayala, you have to be sure. Ayala, don't get there, they suspect too. <laughs> yeah. And most of these people, one man more, one man played, one can shake her. Hmm. In fact, let me shock you. I'm going to University of Ifa. Yes. Because as a fact, see, you know that if I order the guideline, see on Rumi Lama and Lo. There is one essay fact that I say to people all the time. He did be ding or barabi or bar of authority or budaye or shall kill fidi da funka. Meaning that the Lord God will not give authority to a wicked person. Oh, shall kill fidi da funka. Have it beg bugara yellow kege. If a wicked person is given a sword, the person will do and not do. And if I come on to Jojo Lo, tolo won shoko iya o, aki ishe o bi ba bi ni ille abi eke o. So as I far is like Baba no she man she Bible the way we you know go into the Bible and say the book of Genesis chapter this verse this says this to guide our way of life. So why I'm here is because let me we even need talk to about what you just raised. Okay, sir. Uh, the book of Genesis, chapter forty-four, and verse five. Here, it said, "Isn't this the cup that my master drinks from and also uses for divination?" Mm. This is a wicked thing you have done. They were talking to Joseph's brothers for stealing the cup Joseph uses for divination. I want to ask you, what is divination? What Ifa is as an essence is divination. Now, let us remember that at this point, Joseph was in Africa. Mm -hmm. Joseph was like a high-ranking Egyptian officer. Despite his Hebrew background, he was a high-ranking Egyptian officer. And he had a cup he used for divination. If you read this in New Living Translation, he says, is this not the cup my master uses to predict the future? It's still the same. What if I, if I is divination used to predict the future? The examples of this divination is just that they try to blur it out with the current understanding of Christianity. Exactly. If down to when Christ was nailed to the cross. They cast lots. Mm. What are lots? They cast lots to determine who would have the garments. Is there scripturally? And the most important one, let me read it to you. Acts chapter 1, verse 26. Acts 1, 26. If you read from verse 25, it says, As an apostle to replace Judah in this ministry, for he has deserted us and gone where he belongs. Then they cast lots, and Matthias was selected to become an apostle with the other 11. Mm. Lots is a form of divination. divination to predict just read it this if they say they, they, they um when they throw the cowries of if i'm not an expert on ifa i've mm. read a 
here and there on it. But I know if I is casting lots. Yes, yes. Ah, okay. I want to go on this journey. They will throw the the cows, then they will interpret it. Ah, yeah. it, like it will be like this. It will be like this. That's casting lots. Now, yeah. what we allow them to do, just like the, the first thing you said when you came on this live, you said uh, they make they call our language vernacular. Yeah, vernacular means the language of uncivilized or. Uh, yeah. Uh, of local people. That's exactly what they did with our beliefs. Hmm. They made it look like beliefs of primitive people. Meanwhile, they brought the Bible that most of it, or a whole lot of it, was set in primitive contexts. A place like the book of, I was reading uh, the other day to the audience, what happened to um, Ruth? For mm. them to sell a land, they had to marry Ruth because Ruth was tied to the land. So whoever bought the land married Ruth. Automatically. If that is not primitive, I don't know what primitive is. <laughs> but this boy is here, telling me about Ultra Ragnarsson. Let me give you another example of primitive. The dowry, David, the bride price for David's for Saul's daughter that David paid was mm. the sins of 200 Philistines. He went and slaughtered 200 people, removed the four skins on their manhood and brought it to Saul and they counted the full number, 200, before Saul gave David his daughter to marry. Is that not primitive? When David finished with Goliath, he held his head like this and marched through the city to the king. To the king. That and Boko Haram. Because when they say, ah, Boko Haram people are wicked. Oh, yes, I agree they are wicked. But they are not more wicked than David. <laughs> what they did and they are doing is exactly what David did. Hmm. So, what we now did in our foolishness is we threw away our vernacular and collected their own. Exactly. We threw away our primitive ideas. Oh, that's a primitive idea. Oh, how can you do that? You. And we collected their own you and carried their own you on our head. <laughs> Please, my sister, I just wanted to interject you there. I'm enjoying you. Continue, continue. Okay, continue. so now that as a prophetess, as a Christian, I am promoting the African culture, the Yoruba culture. I tell people, pay, what is Isheshe? What is tradition? Tradition mm. is way of life. How we do things. It is our tradition here. It is our own, it is our way of life. Which is Isheshe? The Yoruba is the Sheshe. Kini tumo is Sheshe. Ishe wa. Nigba ata Sheshe de. How we were behaving. When we, when we came on board initially. Ishe wa. Nigba Ishe da. Nigba Ishe da le. Hmm. Lara Ishe Ishe wa. Is our way of life. How we greet our, our people. How we, you know. Obrini akunle okon yadop ale. The Omolu arbitrate. Of the Yoruba people, Arai Sheshewani. You know, mm. it is our act from the beginning, our act of the beginning. How mm. we behave in the olden days is Sheshe. Ishe, Nibata Sheshe. Nibata, Nibata, Timon Shewa. So it is our way of life in the olden days. Do you understand? It, that is the meaning of isheshe. Mm. There are sacrifices, there are some things that some people can say, okay, are the kill, maybe they kill people, maybe they do sacrifice, maybe they... That is different from isheshe or spiritualism. It is your connection with Olodumari. If you want to use the channel, go. If you don't want to use the channel or you want to talk to God directly, talk to him. So, 
So when people now, I as a Christian, I have a shepherd in my church. But even my shepherd knows that when we talk, he say you better leave that one. I will not come to you and say, ah, daddy, mola, yon, yarami. I saw mosquito. Yeah, I saw, no. Because I believe that I have access to my God. And if there is something that church, celestial church has taught me, is the fact that you can relate to God yourself. You can relate with God. Those mm. of you still, I'm only married to Mangba. If as a celestial member, you still go to prophet and say, a prophet, do this, uh, do, do this, they will scam you. Because they have scammers within us. Same thing in Islam. Same thing in the Sheshi. Now, mm. why am I not a traditionalist? Why am I not an only Sheshi? You won't call me an idol worshiper if I am an only Sheshi. Hmm. I would I would rather love to be addressed as a spiritualist. And if you are a good Christian, you are a spiritualist. If you are a good Muslim, you are a spiritualist. Because dealing with God is in spirit, in spirit and in truth. Hmm. John chapter four, verse twenty-three. So if you are dealing with God in spirit and in truth, it has nothing to do with what channel or what religion are you doing. Now, the reason I don't, I'm not doing a sheshe is because a lot of people that are doing it does not really understand it. Because they know that when you're lower, they will collect it. Uh. The same thing in Christianity. A lot of pastors, a lot of big churches know that our people, if you want to hide something from an African man, put it in a book. Uh. They won't read. They won't make reiki. They won't do research. My pastor say, it is that my pastor say. My imam says, it is what the imam says. So most of these people doing the sheshe too, they do not really understand what the issue. That was why I said, by the grace of God, I'm still going to attend the University of Ifa. Because Ifa has his own Iwemi Mo Ifa. Hmm. Yes. Sometimes, maybe like, the last time I was in Trinidad and Tobago, two years ago, Port of Spain, I, they were having a, a Shogo festival. Meanwhile, I supplied that group Bata drums. So, and it is the belief of the Yoruba people that Bata belongs to Shogo because it has a very funny sound. When I got there, those people were holding my feet. They were calling me ancestor. Yes, because they believe that it is very rare to see somebody doing what I do. If I want to look at how people see me in this thing that I do, it is just because of the fact that I already make up my mind that this is why I'm here. Whatever you have to say, say, this is me. When I attend a program, I see a king speaking in English. I will write notes, give to the DSS. Please speak SO Yorubasa. I was on BBC recently. I told them, I said, it is the responsibility of our kings to promote our language. Mm. Speak to the palaces of the kings in, in the north. You mm. will get an interpreter, oh brother. You will get an interpreter. <laughs> it is only in our palaces here in Yoruba land that our kids will be speaking in English. Not all of them. They are all my fathers, but there are a few of them that speak English. Joker, did you watch Squid Game? No, I, I didn't watch it. On Netflix. No, the movie from beginning, the most the biggest series this year. It was done in Korean language. If you are watching it, you have to be reading. They did not they did not change the language. It was shot in they spoke their uh Korean language, and that was still the biggest series this year so far. The most popular globally, and they spoke their Korean language. That is why we have to also learn to showcase our own language. The reason why some of our children don't even want to learn it is because they don't see it as something cool. Yes, in fact, that's where I'm going. That is for you to want to get involved in something, you have to love it first. Mm. 
love Yoruba land. I love African um, culture with everything. I am an entrepreneur. I'm a broadcaster. I'm a radio presenter. In fact, I was the vice chairman of freelance and independent broadcasters in Ogun State for about four years. What yeah. radio work? I work in about six. I'm a freelance broadcaster. I work in about six in Ogun State. I have programs every day of the week in different radio stations. All the money that I make, I put it in promotion of Yoruba language. I sell <laughs> African fabrics. I have a store for Adire and Ashoke. I do Adire from the scratch. All the money I make, I put it in promotion of Yoruba language. All of my businesses, the little, little change that I see on them, I put it in this thing. Because I believe that it is a destined assignment. Mm. And another thing that is happening is because our parents, they don't make the Yoruba culture attractive to us. It is in between what in Sheboy and the Konoma Jekamo. Meanwhile, Gessi, one more civilized, like the English people brought civilization, they brought the way of life, our way of dressing, how we speak. How we, it is only our language that is our form of identification. You know, they said they type, they said she buy. We do all the same we should do. But our language, our language, that is our form of identification. Our language, our language, that is our form of identification. 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 Our language, that is our form of but stay slave or stay connected if for for those people that knows me they will know that this is not my my original hairstyle i used to carry one african afro look but because of that project i was doing bone straight bone straight um ask madam takes board different kinds of weave on like this one that i have on now because i go to universities to tell people that See, Yoruba is beautiful. Africa, look at me. Will you look at okay? I, I will have I have gadgets on my hand. When you see me, you see the kind of gadget that I use, the kind of car that I drive. You don't want to tell me mm, mm, mm. I represent myself well out there. Mm. So all the all the things that you want to say you do. To face up, okay, I'm a big girl, I'm a big boy. I do it too. But if you allow your language to fade off. Hmm. So, because we have to encourage our youth and let them know that this is who we are. She a lot of people to share your in university. Cut off mark, Lomanja. If anybody tells you I'm studying Yoruba, ask the person very well. Is it that the person wants to study law? And they said, ah, could they be a kilo le shino? A jedu le shi yo back my waste admission. Hello, me fashi communication and language arts. They will say, ah, that cut off my colleague, being cut off fashi. Ah, kilo one le shi, a jedu no faculty of arts, you know, kolo shi yo ruba. Ah, kole do faculty of a jedu no linguistic, ha shi yo ruba. So if I have a project now that I talk with students of SS2 to SS3, that do you know that you can pick Yoruba as a course? Because Yoruba language is fading off. And that is why we are having problems. Yoruba no ni wa Because right now, people do not even know the kind of work you do. They don't want to know where you make your money. Your seat in church and mashalashi remain in the front as long as you have money. Mm. I have uncles who are kings. I have uncles who are prominent kings. Whenever mm. they want to give people chieftaincy title, I say something to them or to their office. I will say, Agbalagba, ti o ken wo soro, o ma ke tonsare. The thing is, if you do not make an in-depth research about these people you are giving chieftaincy title to, the we day are... their major business is unveiled, Mm. Mm. Do you understand? Mm. Meanwhile, in the traits of the Yoruba people, money does not come first. And that is why we are here, we are in the, in the society now. 
The moment the person has money, last born will become first born. Hey, mommy, let me tell you something. I was in I I got I was in a restaurant three days ago. I broke down on the road, so I had to just give myself a break. I was seated. I saw a guy and a young girl. They came in. They ordered for food. No, they were. I was watching them. Are they brothers and sisters? No, they were not. The girl took her phone and said, "Mommy, making a kimba here, She was asking her mom what to get for her from that restaurant. I was not like. While we were growing up, when they were training us, and we got used to it that even now in parties, you will realize that you have finished your food before you eat the meat. Before was, yeah, I see baseball, have you noticed? I still do it till today. That is because that is the way I you do it. Train. Also from small. <laughs> no, that kind of a girl would take that food to her mother. Mama, me mm. ma. If my father who to last one from that junction, everybody will be running their task. You have to get busy. Elijah is coming back home. But look at where we are today. That girl will take that food home and the mother will eat it. And when you they don't want to care where did you make your money, how do you make it? Is it like is it legit? Is it this? Is it that? The moment what war is involved, and that is why the society is getting rotten by the day. Right. They will say our politicians are stealing. But you are the one that will go to honorable and say, Honorable, you are be more. He wasn't there when you were sleeping with your wife. And I say, you are honorable. Something. Where do you want him to get the thing he's going to give you from? Yes, it's from the constituency project fund. It will give you, but that constituency project will not come, it will not come to reality because it will well away. Hmm. So it is our tradition to live a good life. Iwamolua B is our tradition, is our way of life. So that is phrase I'm asking you, connecting to our ancestors. Onomila said, Kashirere, Kama Waika, Kama Rotomo Lakeji Nibi, Jackie Inuemo. If I decide to connect to all those things, that I want to be good, I want to do good to everybody, I want to be plain, I'm not going to do evil. If I'm connecting to that, and somebody is saying connecting to my ancestor is evil, and to how do I explain myself? Hmm. You see, um, we're going to have another session. We've already been here for one hour. Uh, we're definitely going to do this again, Joker. Uh, okay. This is important. Um, I don't... You see, in Islam, there's good and there's bad. Mm. In Christianity, there's good and there's bad. There are things that do not blend with today's world in Islam and in Christianity. Till today. I mm. Ephesians chapter 6, verse 5. Slaves obey your earthly masters. Is in the new... Power. It cannot work. Not anymore. In with our local traditions. There are things in our local traditions that cannot work today. But there are also things in our local traditions, our local cultures and local spirituality that is of essence until today. You will realize something. If you study Matthew chapter 25 from 31 to 41, Christ said at the end of the day, what is going to count when he's coming to carry those who, going to, who are going to heaven and those who are going to hell is did you love your neighbor as yourself? No. When I was hungry, did you feed me? When, and they will ask, ah, when did we see you hungry? When? He said, when, when were you in the prison and we did not come to check on you? You'll be amazed that that is the backbone of traditional worship. Exactly. Traditional cultures put humanity first. The interpretation of humanity is what goes, what is different in one generation or from one generation to the next. But at the end of the day, it is humanity first. You serve God not by praying through Christ but by service through mankind. That is why when you said that thing about Select Church, that your highest um, shepherd sweeps the floor 
He will lead us. So he will lead. You will see poor, rich, wealthy people will wash the toilets. Yes. No, because last week, I don't know if you were in, in service with us last week. I said the only way to worship God is through service. Service to humanity. Humanity. And until human beings are ready to serve other human beings, not the rich ones who, mm -hmm. those who are poor and hungry, it is through them that you can get to God. And that is also the essence of our culture and tradition. Choke, may Yahweh bless you. Amen. And the work you are doing, may you be able to see it to a conclusion. Amen. And hand it over to the next generation. Amen. I am going to send this video. When I'm done, I'm going to download it. I'm going to put it on Facebook. I'm going to put it on YouTube. I'm going to put it everywhere. And I will send a link to Are Afe Babalola Bamufin of Yoruba land. Yoruba land. I want to send it to him. Let him see that our culture and tradition are being preserved. And I'm sure he'll be... You know what it is to be Bamufin of Yoruba yeah. land? Yeah. That's yeah. a conk Yoruba title. Yes, a very strong word. So, uh, Joke? Yes, sir. In two or three minutes, please give us your parting take so that I don't want the video to be more than one hour because people are still going to watch it on Facebook. They're going to watch it every and okay. them. Okay. Uh, thank you very much, Dad. It's, it's, it's August. We've been on this thing. I'm glad we're able to go. We're doing it again, though. This one, we're yeah. still doing it. This is, this is what I have to say. The fact that you are a Yoruba person does not mean you are, you are inferior. Hmm. Teach your children their indigenous language. If you are Yoruba, teach them Yoruba. If you are Igbo, teach them to speak their language. If you are Hausa, teach them to speak Hausa. Then another thing is in this society that we find ourselves so unfortunate that people are placing money over value. Value is above every other thing. Iwa is very important. How you are able to hold yourself. How you are able to control your 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 man will call it a conjure. Do you understand? Mm. So as a Yoruba person, it is very important for us to protect our cultural heritage, our cultural value, because this is the only thing that belongs to us. We cannot begin to continue to we cannot continue to um study who we are by the thesis of the Europeans. We can mm. study who you are by your own way of life. We are Yoruba, we are Africans. The, the more we rely on their own thesis, the more we get grounded in what we are not supposed to be grounded in. Mm. So you can be beautiful, you can slay, do bone straight, do everything, but stay connected to your roots. I tell people, I'm running a challenge now. I'm an Adire addict. Mm. I am an, we are Adire everywhere. Two, three years ago, I was at British Council to meet um, Laurel. Everybody was suit. I was the only one that wear a dress. The woman told me, she said she doesn't take gifts, but she wants this. Hmm. Yes. Laurel, I think she was the, the well, what do they call them at the embassy? What's up, The high commissioner? The high commissioner. She says she, she doesn't take gifts, but she wants this. So it is just to make yourself, yourself unique. A lot of people are speaking English. I tell people, I say, A lot of people are speaking English. A lot of people are wearing suits. A lot. So let us protect. See, the revitalization of our African culture is a collective responsibility. Mm. As you are leaving this stage, you are leaving this platform, Go back into your house and make sure you revitalize your the African language. So that's all I have to say. And I want to say thank you very much.
So, brother, God thank bless you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Ajoke. Uh, I'm proud of you. Is it Ajoke or Adejoke? Adejoke, Ajoke. So, it's Adejoke, YB. Adejoke, YB. Ade Joke, hey, because I know Ajoke is Oriki. Yes. Ade is a name. Yeah, so I am Ade Joke Ajoke. I came oh, okay. So so that's why I tell people I say it is this is not for money, it's for passion. It's for passion. It's uh. for passion. God bless. <laughs> Thank you so much, everyone, for joining Thank in. You. Thank you. Make sure you support this lady. Let's see how we can keep this alive. And remember, religion and spirituality are two different things. Different things. I'll be part two. Take uh, care. Take care.